There is no positive reaction on the main issue in this document. The main issue is our clear position on the inadmissibility of further expansion of NATO to the east and the deployment of strike weapons that could threaten the territory of the Russian Federation reaction on the main issue in this document. The main issue is our clear position on the inadmissibility of further expansion of NATO to the east and the deployment of strike weapons that could threaten the territory of the Russian Federation. NATO issues in this document. The main issue is our clear position on the inadmissibility of further expansion of NATO to the east and the deployment of strike weapons that could threaten the territory of the Russian Federation. Now, let's look at let's look at where this These people are located. So you have Russia at the top. And then you got Iran, Afghanistan, all their allies. But let's go to let's pull up I was looking for a map it talks it said meads clearly but all right let me go back to my maps. okay history of meads. Media. Because the Persians, they were in this area. So, pretty much, this are up, up by Armenia. That's where the, the, the the Russians are, and Persia and Iran is, Iran is where Persia is at, and Russia is where media is at. All right, let's go back. Let's go back to Russia. Okay, so Iran is at the far. Let me blow this up. Iran is at the far left. And Russia is right above um, Iran. So when it talks about the Medes, it's pretty much talking about the people above Persia. Because Persia was in the south and the Medes was in the north. OK, 
Okay, let me go to these prophecies about the Medes. Start with Isaiah 13 and say, Behold, let me see if they give me the. Behold, I will stir up the Medes against them which shall not regard silver, and as for gold, they shall not delight in it. Okay, Isaiah 51 11. It said, Make bright the arrows, gather the shields. The Lord have raised up the spirit of the kings of Medes. For his device is against Babylon to destroy it, because it is vengeance of the Lord. It is the vengeance of the Lord, the vengeance of his temple. 51 28. Prepare against her the nations with the kings of the Medes. So that's all the allies in Russia. The captains thereof and all the rulers thereof and all the land of his dominion. And this is the same thing that happened during the first Babylon. What came against the first Babylon was the Medes and the Persians. The uh, people in that that uh area but now um the same thing is going on today okay i think that's it on the meads so yeah he said he's gonna raise up the spirit of the king he's gonna put it into their spirit stir up the Meads against them. And so that's what Ezekiel was talking about. Let's go ahead and get Ezekiel. Ezekiel 38. Now mind you, the Meads is in the same area as Magog. And verse 5, it say, Persia, Ethiopia, and Libya with them all, all of them with shield and helmet. And so, these nations is going to come up against Babylon the Great because NATO is allies to America. And America, let's get this real quick. Revelation 17, 16. Now it says, the ten horns which thou saw upon the beast. That means the ten horns in America, they are allies. And so, these allies in America is getting too close to Russia. And Russia is saying, we not going to let y'all just get close to us like that. Where y'all can have an easy attack on us. We, we, we finna get y'all up off of us. Or take over some of these lands that's around us. So you don't have a, a easy attack. And that's what the the, the um, that's what the prime minister was saying, um, that they not um, the main issue is not being discussed, even though the CIA going to Moscow and talking to the Russians and trying to be diplomatic about it, but they're not bringing up the main issue, or they're not addressing the main issue. Of y'all are just too close to us, and we don't we don't feel safe with y'all being this close to us. And so, um, the U Ukraine they they don't understand that they're trying to get around that, and they don't want to address that. But that's the elephant in the room, and it's gonna come to the point where Russia is gonna demand that these 
anybody close to them gonna have to be on their side. They can't join with America because they can destroy them and America ain't gonna be there to save them. So that's what and they might even destroy them and America don't show up. And then that's might what make these other the allies of America hate the whore. Hate America because the America don't come rescue them and look out for them, even though they're allies when Russia attack they behind. Or Russia threaten them and just come on in like the the Medes and the Persians did to Babylon. They might it might not be a major war, but they know what they can do. Because the, the, these uh, ten horns, the ten kings, will turn on the whore and hate her. See? And this is what we're seeing. The process of these nations starting to, to hate the whore. And these Medes are the Russians. And so... Uh, you got the Persians, they are the Iranians, and they are already close allies. And the Lord said he's going to stir up the spirit in them to destroy Babylon. And this is why he said in verse 17 in Revelations, he said, For God has put it into their hearts to fulfill his will. So he, he stirring up their spirit and putting it into their heart. To hate America. And America going to force their hand to have to destroy America. But the Lord is doing all these things. And he is moving fast in what he's doing. But yeah, I just want to um, point that out about the Medes. And, and being the Russians. In, in that area of Russia, in Iran, they're going to be the ones that the Lord going to stir up against America, Babylon the Great. But I'm going to leave it there. All praises to Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shah, by Hashem, Kakadash, double honest to the elders, pushing the true peace of the elect worldwide, the blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans, descendants of slaves, scattered around the globe. Our kingdom is at hand. Shalom.